Hello everybody and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays Crusader Kings 2. In the last episode we got extremely close to our series goal of restoring the Roman Empire right here. We have, we got the last little mosque down here, which is not a mosque anymore, it is now a bishopric. Uh, right down over here we were fighting the Umayyad rebels, we grabbed that. And then we declared war for the last county we need to get inside our realm, which is this one right now. And we are 40, we've uh, sieged down three of the four holdings. We are 47% through that war. So right now all we're doing is waiting for this war to end and waiting for our prestige to climb. Because I need 3,000 prestige to be able to use the intrigue option. Now, right now, we are in a extremely, extremely stable position. The The Mongol hordes are on the way, but they're not going to be here for a while. And we're auto-saving, of course. Why does it auto always auto-save right as soon as I start? We're auto-saving. We've got, we got a little construction going. Is this is this part the the start of the horde? High chief. What is a high chief? I'm assuming this is the horde right here. Tribe. I'm assuming that's the horde right there. Humania. Anyhow, uh, I'm not really worried about them too much at the moment. They might pose a problem in the near future, but uh, right now I'm really more concerned with my goals that are at my fingertips. Uh, they're very close, and I'm getting really, really excited to be able to just click that button I've been staring at for months now. Well, this series is one episode a day for 116 episodes now. So yeah, we've been going for close to four months. Auto saving again, really? Well, that's what I get for playing on a higher speed. Higher speed than one, I guess. And we're just using our our retinue to do this, so not even not even actually using my actual troops. Look at that. Twenty five about twenty five hundred prestige now. Thirty seven weak claims. I still can't look at that list. Vassal inheritance worrying, I'm not too terribly concerned about. And um it was informed to me that if you're over your vassal limit, it also affects your levy size, which I didn't realize. I thought it just influenced your tax income and maybe gave you an opinion debuff. But no, I was informed that it did actually affect other stuff as well. All right, nice. And in case you guys uh, haven't been here for an episode or two, look at how amazing this guy is. He, oh, I love him so much. 80,000 troops at his command right now, 80,000. This is the first excellent ruler I've had since the, I, I became the emperor of the Byzantine Empire. First really, really good ruler. All right, we're almost done here. 88.7%, you have a new heir, excellent, and we just had a son. Why don't we name him Benjamin as well? Oh, shit. I forgot to put a four in there. All right, we fulfilled our ambition, so we need another one. Uh, have a daughter, I guess. And after, now that, you know what, maybe now that I have a, a son, I should change this. Hmm, what could I do? I could do... If I did... Which one of these, I'm wondering which one of these allows me to go on a pilgrimage? Theology? Uh, I have to wait till two, or I have to wait a couple more years, so, okay. Not a big deal, just have to wait a little bit longer. We finish this siege down here. And inherit the kingdom of Jerusalem from Clement the Wise. Now let's pause this real quick. My sister needs uh, to be educated. Let's get the entrusted ward thing going. Anatolia. No, oh, it was Alania. I was th I messed up. For some reason, I confuse An Anatolia and Alania sometimes. So, we need a new King of Jerusalem. Not you.
I only have duchesses down here. Though I guess I'll hang on to it for now. It's fine by me. I'll just hang on to that for now. No big deal. Now, is there anything else for me to do here? Uh, am I at war with that guy? No. What did we got a s supply limit here of twelve thousand? Let's move over here. Wait, no, that's not the, that's not even the guys I'm at war at. With I'm I'm at war with. I mean, I don't think. Wait. Oh, that's who I'm fighting for. I was like, I'm fighting against him. No, that's uh, contested. He he's the one who wants that land. All right, let's get ourselves a new court chaplain. Let's look at the religious tab here, and let's try to take care of some of these heresies. Right there. And let's look at revolt risk real quick. Let's move this guy. Um, suppress revolt. There. Because we have a pretty high revolt risk of 55%. It's really the first time I've ever had to look at that map mode and really use it. After years of careful planning... Oh, shit. We got a host. We got a host coming. Uh, I'm not terribly worried about that. Why do we have troops up, though? I don't remember raising 60,000 troops. What? When the hell did that happen? No, not 60,000. Sorry, I was looking at that wrong. Uh, I don't remember raising up troops. I don't remember hiring troops. Oh, you know what? You know what I bet? I bet that was from because I inherited the Kingdom of Jerusalem. Just miss those guys. Don't need them. Let's get those guys down. I don't want anybody up right now. Educate child. Sure. Uh, educate my sister. Educate child. Send them off. Those people will like us a little bit more. Alrighty, nice. So, now, can we... No battles have been fought. My war score of 63% is just because I control all of this stuff. No, I did fight a battle. Apparently it was for about a percentage point. Is there any... Does he have any other lands anywhere? That I could siege down? Where is his, where is his other stuff? Oh, come on. Goddamn autosaves. Killing me. Okay, let's see here. Uh, if we go to diplomatic relations. Oh, nice. Praised for a sense of justice. So he owns this province and this province. And that's it. I don't, I don't want to march all the way up there. I would probably take ridiculous attrition along the way. Yeah, I think I would. Well, I guess what I could do is try to march... Like, take take a circuitous route. What is it? Shift to make a custom route? Uh, okay. He's not my steward. That's fine. Okay, custom route, and hopefully we can get over there without taking any attrition. And, I don't know, may I might actually occupy my way up to 100% before that even occurs, but we'll see what happens. All right, let's see, what are our opinions? Everybody loves us except for this, this bitch over here. Why do you not like me? What did I do to you? Uh, wants control over the city of Nablus, wants control of the kingdom of Jerusalem, title claimant, medium crown authority. Medium crown authority? Is that for Jerusalem? That must be for Jerusalem. Because it's definitely not for the Byzantine Empire. Now, right now, if I wanted to, I could increase Crown Authority and it would probably pass. That, and I, and I want it to pass. I do, I do want it to pass. What if the Pope likes me enough to give me money? I keep wanting to check. Uh, request money. Cost me 100 piety. Ooh, nice. You are a benevolent pope indeed. What is what is that siege? Is that down over here? Wait, was that actually an enemy army? Of 400 men? Alright, 80%. Look how close we are. Oh my god, are we actually going to do it this episode? 
Oh, I'm going to fucking die if we actually do it this up. But whoa, what happened to Aquitaine? Okay, apparently Germany decided it was going to beat the fuck out of Aquitaine and take a bunch of their land. Go Germany. What the hell is this? A Worden? What the hell is a Worden? King of a Worden. King of Alban. A Worden? Alban? I guess it's Ireland and Scotland. England has been a goddamn mess this entire game. But Ireland's been kicking some... Whoa, 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 whoa! What just happened? What the hell just happened? Oh, okay. Everybody and their mother just joined in this holy war. That's unfortunate. Okay. Um. God damn it. Fuck. Okay. Well, let's send you back this way. God damn it. Ah, I was really hoping to end this e nice and smoothly. But doesn't look like that's gonna fly. Let's grab all of these guys, try to get them over here if we can. You know what? These guys, they're just gonna get wiped out if I try that, so let's try to get let's just disband them. I don't I don't even I'm not even gonna put them up. Um these guys down here, you can disband, not gonna use you. Not gonna use you. No point in taking the opinion hit on guys I don't I'm not even gonna ever use. All right, so now we're going to need our ships again. Fleet levies, so let's raise those up. And just like always, we're going to head to Rome. And now we're going to unpause. I'm a little bummed at that. I was really hoping to be able to smoothly end this. Now we're actually going to have to fight it out. A little bummed out. I did not expect, you know, 82% of the way through this war, and then they're just like, okay, now we want in. Oh, well. Well, we'll be able to get a, a decent-sized army together over here and just march them right into the field. They're right next to where they're supposed to be anyway. I, what I'm, I, I might be able to wait this out, but if they seize, siege down these lands and take them back, then it's going to just drop right back down. Little bit bummed out at that. I was expecting it early on, but when nobody joined in, I kind of figured they weren't going to. Apparently when they saw the war going really shittily for their 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 Muslim brothers, they decided to join in. Yeah, and it looks, are they sitting there? They are sitting there. Did I actually have time to get some... I had time to get a garrison in there, but not any anybody else, really. Okay, well... What is the attrition going to be like over in these regions? All right, I can I can get a decent sized army around the coast here, twenty thousand men. And uh, we've got more than that coming into Constantinople right now. Okay, we'll fight this out. We'll win. It's just going to take a little bit longer. All ready. 1700. It still boggles my mind that I have that many ships. Alright, men coming in still, men coming in still. If I'm wrong, if this isn't the Horde, you let me know. But it kind of seems like it is. I mean, they're chiefs. They have tribes. Seems like that's the way it should be. Alrighty. 86%. Are they not sieging? No, they are sieging it down. It's just the sieges are right now really pushed far down. Okay, they're sieging a bunch of stuff. All right. We're going to take care of them, though. No big deal. We're going to take care of them. <laughs> Man, do I have a lot of troops. All right. Now, how many can I get in? What is the supply limit like through my my land is even not even that high? Um, in half. 18,000. 18,000 safe, though. Right? 21... 18,000 safe. We're going to send one army there. Yeah, that's relatively safe. 
I would rather, re really rather not have you go through land where you're going to take attrition, so we're gonna custom route it over this way. And we're gonna send these guys, I'm gonna kind of kind of send them up this way, I think. We're over there. Alright. Alright, we're doing, this will be okay, we'll be fine, we'll be fine, we'll take care of this shit. Might not even need the troops I have all the way over there. 87%. I don't want this. I don't want them to successfully siege anything down, though. Did anybody else join me? No, it's just me. It's just me. Maybe a couple nice battles will get me enough war score to end it. Thanks to the Pope, I am once again a ridiculously rich, miserly bastard. Although, you know what I could do if I wanted, is I could continue some construction. Might as well. Use the Pope's money. I mean, I think I'm still capped out in these places. Yeah, just blow all the Pope's money on new construction. Why not? No point in not doing it. Training grounds. Yeah, get that training ground built. There we go. Pope's money's gone now. All right, these guys are almost where they need to be. Gonna wipe out that little army there, and then we're gonna move on and try to fight these guys over here. Let's, um, what did we got here? Okay, we'll, we'll be safe if we head over this way. But I wanna head this way like this. All right, good, good, we caught them. 91%, if we're really, really lucky, I'll be able to end this before this, they siege out any land. All right, did, wait, are they moving out of the province though? It looks like they are. Is it looks I know we're auto saving right now, but it looks like those two icons are in the the, the moving animation. No, no, one of them's wait. No, no, they did move. 91%. What is this little battle going to get me up to? 94%. I think that was my sister that just became of legal age. Uh relations. Um siblings. Yeah, it was her right there. We'll take care of her. And this army is going to be heading right down over here. Let's see what is the? I could siege down. I, I could sit here and siege. Maybe maybe assault down a holding. And try to end this. And try to just like blitz end it. I think that would be a good idea. Oh, okay, we might we we might have time to do it this episode. Oh my god. Twenty nine hundred. 95%? What do we got here? Three- oh, that's a lot of men. Alright, so they're gonna- they're gonna arrive. Alright, let's head- head down over here and try to- try to smack their army. I mean, it's gonna be a- a, a bad- I'm gonna take some bad penalties hitting that- hitting them because I think I'm gonna have a river crossing and mountains, but I just wanna- anybody actually get out in time. September 10th will arrive September 14th. Yeah, no, it's not gonna fly. 96%. Send these guys right down over here. This army might... It might not be a good idea sending this army into the field like this. They have a lot of men. That 10,000 men just kind of disappeared on me there. Alright, let's try to hit these guys. Again, just trying to blitz... Blitz end this... This war. 97%. Who joined me? I don't even know. 97% still. I was really hoping that battle would uh, get me something. This might be a bad idea. Uh, what do we got here? Annoying my oath is just ask me to do the matter in Alright, this is the Grandmaster. Grandmaster Odeker the Spider. Man, that's a cool name. Oh, right, she already loves me. So I'll take the minus 10% hit on her because she already fucking loves me. 99%. Again, trying to trying to end this, but without actually having to do much. One more tick should do the trick, and that should end that war. One more occupation tick should do it. 
And we're fighting, so somebody's fighting a battle down there. Mayor of Greece. Mayor Michael of Greece. Yeah, he's kicking some butt down there. He's really kicking some butt down there. 100%, 100%, 100%. Now let's double check something. Byzantine, Byzantine, Byzantine. 3,108 prestige. Let's get these guys out of enemy territory. All right, I want, I want, hang on. I'm just gonna, just gonna micromanage my armies real quick before I do anything interesting. Oh my God, I'm shaking a little. County, you usurped a county, no big deal there. So I want to make sure everything's nice and set and even before I do anything drastic and crazy, and that's going to make me flip out. All right, all right. Lower that. Let's go to our military. Let's get rid of everybody. Let's get rid of... Oh, come on, you auto-saving son of a bitch. Autosave, you are a fickle, fickle bitch. Disband. Disband. Alright, so where did my retinue end up? Let's send them back to Constantinople. Uh, okay, 8,000 there, 2,000 there. Okay, we're good. So now we're going to take a quick little peek over here. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, there it is. Oh my god, I'm going to click it. The dawn of a new era. Friends, Romans, countrymen, lend me your ears. After the miraculous recovery of territory lost centuries ago, the Roman Empire has been reborn. Europe has endured dark times since the imperial frontiers were stormed by barbarians and province after province burned at their torch. But now a bright new age has dawned for all civilization. The Roman state will no longer be referred to as the Empire of the Greeks by jealous pretenders in the West, but recognized as the true heir to the legacy of Rome. Emperor Benjamin III rules a restored Imperia Romanum, but much work remains to be done. There is still territory to recover and ancient borders to reclaim for the Senate and the people of Rome. Oh my god. Has granted the Roman Empire. Uh, is granted the Roman Empire. The Byzantine Empire is forfeit. Emperor Benjamin III of the ben uh, Byzantine Empire gains the trait Augustus and will be known as the Glorious. All right. <laughs> Roman Empire. <laughs> uh, oh! Ooh! 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 Achievement unlocked. Legacy of Rome. I'll restore the Roman Empire. Nice. Okay, 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 okay. Emperor Benjamin the Glorious. Augustus is currently the ruler of the restored Roman Empire and commands the respect and office of such magnitude as due monthly pers vassal opinion of plus 15 just for shits and giggles oh my god that is so amazing between born in the purple and Augustus you get a vassal opinion bonus of plus 25 64,000 troops 86,000 men Oh my god. Emperor Benjamin III, the glorious of the Roman, at 19 years old, you are a glorious motherfucker. Oh my god, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's uh, collect some taxes over in Rome, the proper capital of the Roman Empire. Now, I probably should do this. Probably should do this. Let's see, military, everything's good here. I heard, ooh, 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 I just noticed that. I just noticed that that the flags turned into little Imperian, uh, Imperial Roman. It says Byzantine Army. Fuck you. Why does it say Byzantine Army? It should say like Roman Legion. Okay, okay, no big deal, no big deal there. All right, so now let's hold a grand tournament. Got to do that. No point not doing it. Let's see, is there anything new in here? Nothing new in there. We got some plots. We got some prisoners. Let's get rid of them. Don't need them. All right. No, not a single faction in the Roman Empire. And funny that it's um, Catholic. But uh, look at that. It's a little Imperial Roman flag. I love it. 
Oh my god, I can't believe we fucking did it. Look at that. Roman Empire. Oh, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. I love it. I love it! Now these guys fucking love me. Personal diplomacy, vice royalty, mar- high mar- Wait, having a high marshal gets you an opinion bonus? Has it always done that? Uh, technology... I didn't- I didn't even know being a genius made people like you. Genius, born in the purple, Augustus, kind, just, uh, charitable, prestige- God, these people fucking love me. Now, let's... Let's do it, let's do it right now. Let's see how well it works. It, it, it should pass with flying colors. Because everybody fucking loves me. Tell me more of your tales of Hindustan. Praise Jeebus. Very kind, I accept your gift. 49. Alright, it's gonna take a little while for that to, to rack up. Now, something I'm wondering about. Now, do I have a permanent cost of spell eye against these people? Holy War, Holy War, du jour War. Now... Hmm, let me... Th it's time to turn it to begin. Okay, now let's go to Aquatan. I just want to look at something. Most unfortunate. Uh, let's actually pause this so those don't keep popping up while I'm looking at this. Declare war. Okay, here it is. Imperial Reconquest. That's what I'm looking for. I have an Imperial Reconquest of all the duchies that used to be part of the Roman Empire. Lost territory of the Roman Empire must be reclaimed. Can use this cost of spelly to seize all titles held by King Pons of Aquitaine within the de jure duchy of... Uh, Overgene. So now, I can pretty much go to war with any fucker in the world for shits and giggles. Alright, let's take a look at how this is going. 61. It's, it's, uh, creeping up. Like, does, is this pissing people off before anything happens? Uh, Foreigner. Now, um... What about revocation of titles? It's just gonna piss people off. I still, it's still not free. Okay, okay, okay. Man, is that... Who is this? I don't even know who you are. I don't really care if people get injured. Well, let's see, what about these guys? Do I have... Can I do that with... Do I have re Imperial Reconquest for them as well? Du jour, du jour, du jour, du jour. No, it's just a lot of du jour stuff. Tragically wounded. Uh... Been a lot of people got wounded this time around. I, I just love that it says Roman Empire. I'm such a huge Roman history nerd. You guys have no idea how big of a nerd I am when it comes to ancient Roman history. And I just love that I'm playing Crusader Kings 2 is the Roman Empire right now. But we are officially at the end of this episode. So next episode will be the first one where we play the entire episode. And wow, look at that. Go Ireland as the restored Roman Empire. God, this is going to be a blast. So much fun. Look at that Roman Empire. So happy with that. And we're, we're going to start steamrolling some bitches now. So everyone, if you have enjoyed this episode, just drop me a like. Leave me a comment right down below. And if you are interested in more Benjamin Magnus Plays Crusader Kings 2, subscribe to my channel and I will see you next time.